It's what most people would throw out in the trash. But in this University of Missouri lab, food scraps is the focus of research. It does smell pretty bad. I've gotten pretty, pretty used to it now at this point. This large, dirty looking fish tank is actually a food waste digester. The goal is to turn the waste into electricity. Food waste, anything that's highly degradable, should not really be going into a landfill. David Bruni, a researcher in the MU College of Agriculture, Food and Natural Resources, is converting food waste into methane gas. The methane is essentially an energy source that can supply electricity directly to homes without using fossil fuels. Trash at landfills decompose and produce methane gas. If not captured, the greenhouse gas can be damaging to the atmosphere. Cities like Columbia collect the methane and use it to fuel generators that produce electricity for more than 1,500 homes. If we can beneficially reuse it, which we're doing through the electrical process, then that's all the better for the environment. The MU research keeps food out of the landfills. Large-scale digesters could be more efficient in capturing energy and have less impact on the environment. What we're trying to do is find a recipe. That recipe balances food waste and other organic matter to get the most methane gas cheaply. The leftovers can be used as a fertilizer. The ultimate objective is to recycle everything that can be recycled or digest and convert back into fertilizers or, or a source of energy so that we don't have to use spaces like this to landfill. That's the ultimate objective. From the University of Missouri, I'm Kent Faddis reporting.